I have seen schools saying for us we do things differently here, but when you go there, you see the same things. If I'm an appropriate of a school, I say, pay your fees, I take charge of your medical bills for your child. In addition, there is a life cover that should the parent or the guardian die during the course of the term. I will take over fees for the remaining cycle of the primary bit. Uh, pay the fees. Should your child get a disability at school, they will get this compensation. And I will, I will give that at no cost. The school pays the insurance and incorporates it as a cost of doing business. When that school says that we do things differently, I will surely believe. And if I want to outcompete my, my colleagues in the sector, I would do that. At a very small amount of money, I stand out and be counted. I will even get students from the neighboring schools because they will hear that when you go there, there is this and it's real. So, really, we are encouraging people to think about insurance because the costs are insurmountable. We have shared with them experiences based on research what has happened in this country. I've talked of 95 fires in just one year. The motor vehicle accidents you cannot count. So it is obvious that these risks are there. Now, the other issue, people are worried about the claims. What is the role of the regulator? Actually, what has brought us out here is to give the public assurance that there is somebody you can run to. Number one, it is wrong, absolutely wrong, and we condemn it in the strongest possible terms, for an insurance company not to pay a claim that should be paid. It is also not good for an insurance company to delay because we do not allow that. We have actually issued guidelines showing the number of days an insurance company should take to have a claim paid. But should it happen that the insurance company is not paying a claim which is payable, and I'm saying a claim which is payable because not all claims are payable. The claimant has submitted all the necessary requirements. The documentation is there. They have even agreed on the amount and send what we call a discharge voucher, but the insurance company is not wiring the money to the account. We are there. We can be contacted, and we shall take on this insurance company.